All right, so we are going to set up boot camp here, and I'm going to try to record it for you. So we're going to browse to an ISO image for Windows 8 Pro. I'm going to choose an external SSD to make the install disk. All right, so now we're going to put in the bootcamp password. And let's see here, let's give Windows I guess 80 gigs. Well, let's round out to 400 gigs on the Mac. Hopefully we can edit this a little later. All right, so I'm busting open my Windows 8 here, and it came with the retail key. It came with a little manual, I guess, and a 32 and 64-bit version of the OS. So I'm going to go ahead and put my Windows key in as it's requested, and then uh, we will resume the video. All right, so it looks like we get our typical license agreement. So we'll do a custom install and looks like we'll go ahead and choose the boot camp because the install is the other 60 gig and then the rest of our partition should be OS X stuff but I'm not exactly sure why they're partition that way. So we're going to hit next. Go ahead and get the Windows install process going and then uh, we'll resume recording later. Alright, so Windows essentially uh, automatically reboots back into the boot camp to finish the installation which is nice. I wasn't sure if I was going to have to hit the uh, option button or not. Okay, so when you first log into Bootcamp and you're not doing it from VMware Fusion, your NIC drivers and other drivers will not work. So what you'll have to do is go into the Win Install folder, uh, the Bootcamp, and then you hit Setup. And the reason I'm recording this from in VMware Fusion is just because I can let you... Well, okay, so it's not going to let me install it, but when you do this within your Bootcamp, It'll then install all your Windows drivers and reboot Windows and whatnot.